Now I'm gonna weave the remaining side and connect it. So I need to remember to look up and see where my stitch was to know where to start. So I need to start under, over, under, over. Now I'm gonna come across, leave my tail, but I don't just want to go back because then these are gonna be separated and they're gonna start pulling apart. So I actually need to, whoops, I just stitch the whole thing up. Ah. Okay, now I have a huge little mess. I'm just gonna pull it out and start over. Okay, so Right here, I am going to do an overstitch, but I'm going to go to the first row where I stopped on the other side, and I'm going to find that hoop, pull it out a little bit, and then I'm going to thread through that hoop. So now I've connected this to make one row. Now I'm going to Continue my weaving, push it up, I'm going to stop and look to find the next loop, which is right there, I'm going to go, I'm going to sew into it, it actually doesn't matter if you sew which way you sew in. Sewed into it. And now I'm gonna go back across and I'm gonna follow my pattern on my red so I have to go under and over and under and over. I'm at the end again, so I need to stop. I need to look. First I need to sew into my stitch. I think it's easier for me to do it this way. And continue with my red. Now it looks like I only have one more row to do for my dovetail. I'm going to stop right there. Now what I could do is take a new thread. I can continue with this thread and I'm going to continue my weaving. So I can just, if I want to just use the red because I have plenty of it left on this, I can just continue weaving straight across and back. Remember, don't pull too tight. I'll take that off. 